Sato from Japan is taking on Nerlan from Kyrgyzstan. And nothing doing now, but Nerlan does have a straight jacket wrapped up. Two overs, tied him up pretty good. Sato rips her arms free, but just in time to provoke a passive call. So she'll go down for, or excuse me, no, I'm not. <laughs> this isn't Greco at all, folks. I apologize. She'll go on the clock first. There's a low level attack to a single, and she has both hands on the ankle, but can't quite collect it. And Mulan does a good job of getting weight on the head. Sato now out the back door, 12 seconds, 11 seconds left, and the referee will blow it dead with 10 seconds left on the shot clock. So Sato has to score here, or else she'll give up the first point of the bow. And... That's exactly what happened. Milan does a good job of controlling the tie in there. She has a good bite on an overhook with the left. An underhook, well, she at least had an underhook on the right-hand side. She loses that and takes a collar instead. Let's see if she goes big here as, oh, that sits her to her behind. She goes single leg as a secondary measure. It is. It has been all Mulan here. There's a another snap down from a headlock. And Mulan trying to get busy on a crotch lock. Goes over on it for two. And Sato is down by three with short time. And that'll do it for the first. So three nothing now for the Kyrgyzstan athlete. by three. Sato makes her way back to the center of the mat. Milan meets her there. There's another low-level attempt for Sato. And short offense here for Nerlan. Snaps into the mat and they'll blow it dead. They'll go back to their feet. You know, she hasn't been able to, a lot of, the, one of the things that, again, one of the things of many that the Japanese athletes do so well is get to the absolute lowest part of the leg and thus not allowing their opponent to sprawl very well. Um, she has been close to that area of the leg. She's been, you know, the heel is different than the ankle, and the ankle is different from the calf. So there's a slide by to a single leg attempt by Sato, and now it will be Nerlan who is passive. So she'll go on the shot clock. Th I can't imagine it would change much of the way that she wrestles, but 3 nothing now the score, and 30 seconds on the shot clock for the young Kyrgyzstan wrestler. Like I said, didn't change a whole heck of a lot. There's a single leg for Merlon. And one point will go on the board for Sato. Snap down, go behind. There's a two-point takedown for Sato. And Merlon is closely out of bounds. And she is out of bounds. There's a no score yet. There's a take, or excuse me, exposure for two. So... 5-3 is the score, and exposure now for Nerlan, and she's keeping her in danger 
That's pretty wise considering they won't blow it dead. And you, she actually has her feet touching. That's pretty illegal. Uh, at least one point now for Sato as they go out of bounds. Six, five is the score. And there's 1.3 seconds left. And she just blew her shot looking at the official. Oh, wow. What a match. 6-5 the winner, Sato. And she'll be headed to the World Championship Finals. Hey, we got a fall brewing on the late stages of Matt A. There is. Doesn't wind up being a fall, but it does wind up 